The John Faber Award honors the best photography in newspapers or news services. The citation this evening goes to Santi Palacios of the Associated Press for coming ashore. The award goes to Mauricio Lima, Sergei Ponomarev, Tyler Hicks, and Daniel Letter of the New York Times for their images of migrants crossing border after border after border in hope of a better life. The photographers scrambled across beaches, marched through fields, and clambered over barbed wire to get their images. Accepting the award for the group is Mauricio Lima. Um, good evening, everyone. Um, I feel extremely grateful to be here uh, tonight uh, along with my colleague Tyler Hicks, Sergei Ponomarev, uh, and Daniel Wetter, who unfortunately weren't able to come here. Um, I would like to dedicate this award to every single refugee I came across last year. People oppressed by wars, people oppressed by wars and social injustice, in especial to the Majid family from Syria, who accepted for 29 days a stranger with a camera as part of their family. From the darkness inside the bush before crossing the Serbian-Hungarian border in, at three in the morning, to the sunny days in the Swedish countryside where they are now living. Uh, thank you for your perseverance and fortitude, Ahmed Majid, your wife Jamila, your lovely children, Zain, Widad, and Farida, who was born in Sweden last November. Thank you for your commitment, uh, thank you for your community spirit, Farid Majid, and your wife Rojin your beautiful children, Silva, Widad, and Nabi. <sighs> Tonight, it's a, it's a very special day. And to make justice to this recognition, I would, I would like to express my deep gratitude to the very high level professionals of the New York Times Photo Department. To you, Michelle McNally, and particularly to you, David First, uh, for your trust, for your reciprocal lo loyalty, tireless, in tireless encouragement and belief on photography as an essential language to achieve important moments in history. And finally, by the end, um, I consider very important to say a few words. I'm from Brazil, um, and I'm pretty sure that everyone here knows what's going on in Brazil at the moment. And particularly, we are ahead of very high level professionals on journalism here. And I would like to express uh, my support of freedom of speech and democracy it, which is exactly what's not going on in Brazil at the moment. So I'm against the coup. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>